John Carl, you have one of the best Instagram pages in baseball. <laughs> you ready to check it out? Yep, let's do it. All right, let's baby. The first one. Only right. a guy like you can pull this off. All right. <laughs> This, I had an event at my high school. They had a little Hall of Fame dinner for me. They said I needed to dress nice, so, you know, why not to bring it back 10 years and give them a little, a little rose pants on them. You mentioned the roses. Awesome caption. I think it might be better than the actual photo <laughs> itself. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I had, to, I had to think a little bit what's the best caption, and I think I did it. Next one, Patrick Renna, Hamilton Porter. Two big home run hitters. That's right, that's right. <laughs> He's bigger than me. This was really cool. Obviously, Sandlot's majority of our favorite movies growing up, so it's just cool to see him uh, on the baseball field and come watching us uh, as we watched him growing up. Out of all the characters, would you say that he was one of your more favorite? Yeah, for sure, for sure. <laughs> he was one of the more funny ones and um, had the best quotes from that movie, for sure. What's up, guys? I'm hanging with Big Al. And what do we do? We hit dingers. We hit dingers, that's right. Another home run hitter that you met. Big Al, yeah. When all of us saw him in the clubhouse, we are like, this This is our favorite player right here. We got to root for him. I'm not sure if he's in, in Little League no more. He might be on the next <laughs> level, but he's coming for us. Yeah, I heard he just reached AAA. Yeah, yeah, right. he's close. He's big League camp. <laughs> Throwback. That's Football right. days. That's right, that's right. Hey, how old, man? Right here, I am 15, 16. Okay. Yeah, you can see I don't got the line up in the hair, just straight buzz cut. Definitely out in the sun a bit more. They probably got two different shoes on, shoes that don't fit. Just run out and get them. Well, you chose the good route, it seems, right? Yeah, yeah, I did, I did. <laughs> Next one. A lot of people, I'd imagine that they think that this is what you look like when you work out, like literally. Just a straight that's piece. The, that's how I do it all the time. This is May 4th, so may the force be with you. Had a little extra time in the clubhouse, so we're making the best of it. That was a good time for sure. Chewy, man, who doesn't love Chewy? That's true. Did you save that mask? Where is it? That might still be in Miami, actually. I need to get it. I need to get it. Bring it up to the New York. Same setup, do it. yeah. <laughs> the same setup. So this is also another workout video of yours which went viral. What were you thinking about during this workout? Because you are just getting after it. <laughs> Make sure that that doesn't sling back and hit me in the face. <laughs> but yeah, that was that's peak off season. So you got to get after it. Test your body, see where you can get it. Yeah, that was actually in New York, a little, little precursor. What really gets you going? Were you like envisioning something on that tire? Like, Shoot, like, beat it into the dude, ground. Straight up beast mode on that one, man. Make it flat, man. Make it flat, don't hit yourself in the face. Get it going. Cool, I'm gonna try that later on today. Yeah, come on, <laughs> we got it. Next one, you and The Rock. Mm -hmm. A lot of people think you guys look alike. Yeah, I'm giving the bootleg people's eyebrow. He's giving <laughs> the real one. But yeah, that was really cool. I was on the set of Ballers, I was on the episode. Just hanging out with him and filming with him, seeing how he goes about his business and uh, gets everything done is really cool because back in the day, I couldn't wait to see him wrestle. After doing that, did that make you want to do more? Do you see yourself getting into acting? Uh, yeah, if the opportunity's there, you definitely squeeze out every bit that you could do, so I'm open to it all. Sun's got for a cameo. Let's go, man. <laughs> <laughs> the spinach post, That's Popeye. Right. That's right. Everybody knows Popeye, you know? I couldn't figure out what I was gonna do for Halloween, so uh, I killed it. Everyone loved it, so um, I might have to bring it back. Which also, this one, you oh, said yeah, dressing up, you love it. dressing up, I and this is definitely this it. back too. You gotta bring the, the Austin Powers chest hair in it. That's the main thing. I could've went out just in the chest hair and, and got it done. This is the same year, so a few different costumes, and it's fun. Oh, And here's right. another yep. gym. This is the hairy chest night. Just at home, ready to, ready to get it on the dance floor once I get out, you know? Just get a little, you get the blood flowing a little bit. That's like after you cook like a nice breakfast, you're about to get the day started, you got, right? You know, you, you set your goals for the night. It's like you gotta get it down on the dance floor. Be the man of the hour. <laughs> <laughs> so this video that you had posted on your Instagram feed was great because at this moment, it seemed like you knew that it would be some sort of meme, some sort of gift, and you ended up having some fun with it on your yeah, feed. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, for sure. I mean, who doesn't love naps, right? I mean. You, you always gotta leave time for a nap, <laughs> and this incident right here is mid-game. You just make a play, take a quick little nap, and get it on. <laughs> you love to do some traveling, and you post some great photos of that. 
where was this? And that is definitely one of your different looks. Hey, let it ride. You're on vacation, you enjoy yourself. So this is in Cabo. You gotta have the cowboy hat there. And um, I was in my robe and just decided to take a little dip. That is the life. Let it ride, let it ride. And so is this, man. You got a chance to go to Egypt. That was one of the coolest things I've ever done, actually. Back growing up in school, it's just like, you get the history, the hieroglyphics, all the, the original skyscraper, really, these were. So just to be able to go on the camel ride there and hang out is it, a magical place. And yeah, you gotta have some fun, take some cool photos. You never know if you'll be back or get a chance to go back. Here's another costume. Sensing the demon. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, you, <laughs> you my fun, favorite man. holiday. You, <laughs> you figure that out yet? Uh, <laughs> this was just getting ready for Egypt, man. I mean, I couldn't take this outfit out there, tragically, but this is me just getting ready for it. Those kicks are sweet, by the way. I know, I know. Those are cool. Those are cool. I think they wore those back in the day in Egypt, too. Ooh, imagine it. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing like Cleopatra in some of these. Yeah, yeah. Some high heels like that. <laughs> <laughs> Again, you love having a great time, mm -hmm. having some fun with a monkey. Yeah, so this is at Zoological Wildlife Foundation in Miami. This was a cool little monkey. He'd like jump and grab my hand, like, oh, we're going, we're going this way. Like, All right, man. It's crazy how strong and intelligent they are, because you see they kind of pick you apart, like, hmm, what can I get away with here? Is I jump on his back or, you know, play with his leg or something? So it's cool to interact and see their intelligence. He might have been trying to take you down. He's like, wow, that's yeah, a big guy. He's about to Haven't put me in a headlock like there. <laughs> <laughs> Have you gotten a chance to do this just yet? Because I you haven't. did post saying you'd love to go to this. Spot. I haven't. That is what I need to do. It seems really cool. I gotta make sure I can stand on those without falling off first. Uh, I think you can. You got some pretty strong legs. We'll, we'll see. I, I gotta do that. I, I do gotta do that. <laughs> this one was funny. Mm -hmm. You got a hold of somebody's phone? Yeah, so. <laughs> I got a hold of my friend's phone and I might have took like 300 photos like this, just all the way around, like <laughs> out selfies, all this stuff. So it's funny, I usually do that when my buddies leave their phones around, so. Amazing. That's how I like it. <laughs> Let's see what you got, brother. All right. <laughs> Got some of you on there already, you didn't even notice. <laughs> Your next post, will you bring this ritual inside the Yankees clubhouse at some point? <sighs> oh man, I, I do think we need something like this. We definitely got the materials. And especially especially all the feats that the guys in there make, like CeCe's got a good one coming up, so we can put CeCe in the basket and trash him with whatever we got. But this is like if someone, milestone or a big feed, first win, first save, stuff like that. So it's a cool little initiation. All right, Cece, there's the warning. Here we go. Let's do it. Yeah. Learn how to eat a Kit Kat or don't eat them at all. Last one. You've probably seen this over and over That's and right. over. That's right, and I stand by it because people... <laughs> <laughs> because <laughs> they, they can't understand it, but I mean, I need to stack two of them on top and, and eat it just like that. <laughs> they don't get it. They don't get it. Was this one of the first times that you really saw the power of social media? Because this was literally everywhere. They love that, everywhere. yeah, yeah. That, that, that was pretty funny. Just the buzz of they're like, how can you do that? How can you, how can you break the rules like that? It's pretty funny, man. <laughs> um, so I, I continue to do it. I'm sorry, but that's just what happens. <laughs> So we see all these fun posts, you love traveling, you love dressing up, and obviously there's the baseball post, but what would you say is your favorite part about Instagram? Really, you could you could keep up with everybody. You know, you could, you could see what your friends are doing, especially with our schedule and lifestyle. We're all over the place, so we can't always catch up and, and see what everybody's doing, but you can kind of follow and stay up with, with your friends uh, without kind of being around them. And, you know, you get news and and um, you can follow funny accounts to keep light of things, and you know, it's, it's good. You do a good job with uh, staying funny, especially with the captions. Do you make all of them up yourself? Yeah, maybe ask for some ideas, but then ultimately, of course, I, I make it. Cool, so now's the time for the plug. What do you have to offer and watch somebody follow you? Yeah, I mean, you always gotta have fun. So, you know, you're gonna get some laughs following me. You know, you're gonna get some serious times and make light of situations. And don't leave your phone unattended. Don't leave your phone unattended <laughs> around me. <laughs>